here's another flip through for you. This book is by Anastasia L. Koldareva, and this book is called Blackbird Song. This is one of my favorite illustrators, and she is from Russia, and so therefore this book came directly from her. Some normally I would get it from somewhere else like Korea, then pay to have it shipped here to the U.S. But my connection that a I've always purchased book in Korea. It was nice enough to give me Anastasia's personal email. So therefore, I can request this book from her. And I purchased this book directly from her. And you can do that through PayPal. So, without further ado, let's just jump right into this book. She also signed it for me. And she included a 2022 little glossy calendar and I will probably sit this right where I color at on my gigantic clipboard so I can just look at it. It's absolutely beautiful. Here is the first picture. This is the one I was going to color but like I said I felt ill and I just wasn't up to myself and you know I like to be happy and feeling great when I'm coloring. Here is a dragon. I'm not fond of dragons. In fact, I think I have all her books but the one with the dragon. I don't care for the dragon. But if it's in the picture of yeah, I'll call it a dragon. But not a, I don't think I would want to color an entire book of dragons. But he's good looking. Look at this diva here. Absolutely stunning. She drew this. This is just absolutely wonderful. And I believe that's the name of the flower. And I probably look that up when I color it so I can get the exact color of the flower. Here's another beauty. Look at her. She's wearing her textured hairstyle with a flower in it. I love it. Look at that. Some kind of, what is that? Some kind of salamander. Some kind of dragon. What is that? A kimono dragon. Oh. There's a steampunk lady with her owl. Here's some kind of duchess with a jewel crown. Here's another lady with foliage around her and butterfly. Here's another natural hair diva. I love this. Here's a Victorian like lady with jewels in her hair. And you, as you can see, all of these images are single-sided. It's on great white paper, and you have the spiral binding. So you can tear out your pictures if you want and frame them. That frog. Here's the lady with her Asian outfit on. And here is an image that I did for you guys. Couples, a couple in love. little jewels on her eyelid, her, uh, her eyelid. and uh, his hair doesn't come as wavy as that that's just me freehanding some hair strokes in here here's another with the toucan on her shoulder it's a tropical bird at least it looks like a toucan to me I don't have a clue as to what this bird is her hair is very odd. It's, it's pretty though. She's got some type of seashell hat, a helmet, a crown. It's another Asian picture. It's lovely. She's holding a, what do you call it, a parrot? It looks like she has on African garb. It's another pretty picture. This, I just love this. I like owls. It's exquisite. Here's another, another natural hair beauty. Love it. I love them all. <laughs> this is an Egyptian. And here is the second picture that I color for you guys. I'm going to tell you, these leaves, I just, maybe it was because I wasn't feeling well. And I was just over the leaves. The leaves, it was like... Okay, I'm tired of coloring leaves. And I'm like, am I not done yet? Because, you know, you got to go in and see. Look, in fact, look at this. I just noticed it. I forgot to go in and detail that little space right there. 
<laughs> I did this one, but I didn't do that one. I was over the leaves, but it's it's a pretty picture. I like this guy. Now, he's not going to come with this little goatee and this little hair goatee thing under there. I did that. I freehand that. And, um, yeah. My husband, he has a full beard and he has that little thing here, too. So, I just did it. I didn't want to give him the full beard. <laughs> I started to, but it didn't. So I compromised and did that little bit right there. I was just happening to be talking to my husband. I was looking at him, and I was like, oh, I'm going to manly up, make him a little more mature. I won't say manly, make him a little more mature on this picture because he looked kind of young without the... See how much longer, younger he looks? And I, you know, I did it up a little bit there. And I don't know what made me do a tropical, exotic-looking bug, but... You know, those leaves just said that it looks like an exotic bug need to be crawling on it. And here's another beauty. This is lovely. I love that. Look at that eye. She is giving you the eye. Look at her hair. Look at this. She's got her braids going on and all her jewels. I'm trying to figure out what's the purpose of this, but I guess, you know, it really isn't one. Maybe it's her, her light. You know, she's carrying out her own light. Okay, guys, that is the end of the flip through. You can also look this up to find Anastasia. But I will definitely put her information in the box below for you guys. And also, I think, let me show you all of her books that I have. I have Mysteria. I have Nocturals. And I think I've only called like maybe three or four in each book. Here's Mermaid. <laughs> Excuse me, Mermaids. I said Amara Teen. Amara I don't know. But yeah. Serenity, which was the last one. And here's Blackbird's song. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.